Whoa. Oh. Hey. I thought I was gonna be a magician, but I guess not. I guess I'm I'm window cleaning again. I guess this is some sort of Mr. Miyagi sort of stuff going on. Hello? Is anybody in here? I'm just having a fun time. Ooh, what's that? Window cleaning? What the? What the heck was that? Why did it just whisper at me? Oh no, I killed it. That doesn't seem good. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Welcome everybody, by the way, to Penn and Teller's F U U U and U. Oh, you can see, you can see him back there just heading, mm -hmm. hanging out. Oh. Oh, this doesn't look so good. Hello. What's going on here? Oh. Uh, what help? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, uh oh. Oh no. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. That's great. Okay, I don't know what is going on, but, uh, I don't really want to be here anymore. What the heck is up with that? Oh. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I don't want to be here. I don't, I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. Hello. Oh, crap. Oh, no, 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 no. No. Is there like a dead body around here or something? Oh. This got really serious really quickly. I don't like this one little bit. There's some creepy magic ball. Oh, man. Okay. Just hold on. We got to keep going up. I feel like I'm some sort of crime scene investigator just in disguise here. Hello? Oh, there's a pink thingy. Hello? Oh, shh. Oh, there's eyes. There's freaky eyes. Hello? Ha. Oh, that was open. That was open, and now it's shut. Okay. Is there anyone in the bathroom? Anything under the bed? Where do I need to point my flashlight at? The giant pink base? You got it. It's dancing. That's lovely. Okay, just keep moving. Just keep moving. I mean, so far, nothing really that bad has happened. It hasn't looked all that horrible. Um, just some sort of creepy music going, oh. Well, oh, that doesn't look good. Oh, hold on. That's me. That's me right there on that camera. Hi! What the? Hello? Okay. I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I didn't want to be here anyways. Just go ahead and kill me and get it over with. What is that? Ow! Wait, what was that? Why is there a frying pan on the ground? Oh, someone's been trapped in here. Counting their days and there's a creepy little snowman. No more. Okay, don't like that. Don't like that at all. Definitely being watched. That's okay. Hello? Oh no. Oh no. Um. Oh no. Oh, I don't want to know what's up there. Why is there a bear trap on the ground? Is there anything else? Okay, I don't, just get it over with. I don't want to be here anymore. Okay, I'm just gonna keep on moving. Just keep on moving, pretend like nothing bad is ever gonna happen to me. Oh! oh God, don't make that sound. Don't do that, there's blood. There's a bag of bodies. Oh, there's handprints on the wall. Oh! Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Just a bunch of handprints, a bunch of blood everywhere. Someone definitely died here. Hello, little bunny. How are you? Okay. Alright, here we go. There you go, bunny. Be safe. Oh! Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Okay. I don't want to be here. Just get me out of here. Uh... 
Look up. Ha! Ha! No, 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 don't, 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 don't! Ah! Oh, God! Oh! Oh! That was such a great, such a great time! Great experience! Ha! Ah. Great time! Good time! Good, 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 good time! Good time! Oh, I love this! That was lovely! Okay, welcome everybody to Penn and Teller's F U U and you and you. Oh God. Okay, so this game generally is intended for you to scare and mess with your friends with. Sadly, I don't have any friends to recruit to uh, help me out with this, so we're just gonna do the ones that I can do alone. It's okay though. I'll be fine. I'm a happy person inside. So most of these, like I said, you need friends to actually participate in, but not all of them. We just did the high-rise grime, and we're going to move on now to being Pendulette. Because this one sounds pretty exciting. I mean, who wouldn't want to be Pendulette? It seems like he lived a pretty exciting life. Oh, check out my hands. Hello, buddy. How's it going? Whoa. Oh, you're moving. Oh, oh, it's your actual face if I move back. Oh. Is this it? Moby Dick or the whale This is this is it. This is pretty pretty thrilling stuff, Ben. Yeah. Pretty happy I went with this. I mean, I guess it is a step up from what we just went through, but <laughs> it's not the most exciting of times. At least I can see into your head. Oh man. But I do remember this room. I remember all this. There's the window, there's those guns over there. There was wine dripping, or blood or wine dripping from the ceiling. Spilled wine bottle, okay. So is this it? This is it. Use menu to exit. It literally doesn't even want me to be here. I'm just supposed to stand here and read Moby Dick for an hour. That's exciting. Let's get out of here and go to some more exciting stuff. Oh, cool. Alright, I'll take this card. Thank you. Leaving. Oh, that's, that's a neat little menu. I like that. Oh. Okay, you guys, it's time to guess the cups and balls. Uh, several years ago, huh? Ron and I did a series of documentaries. Oh. We traveled around the world. We can fast close forward and rewind this all one. different America, We used Boop. plastic cups. Oh, that makes sense. That makes and sense. Okay, I'm really good at this. Balls. Just watch Thus very closely. Totally okay, don't lose track totally of what's happening cups here. And balls. Okay, we got three like cups, Take the ball, three balls. Place in your hand. Vanish it. it okay, that one was already there. The He's cup. got one in his hand right now. Watch that one. Ball. Oh, he just put it Place under that cup. Hand. There's a ball under that and cup. He has one in his hand over here. He made it disappear into his hand, and he put another one in that in that cup. Oh, I'm an expert. I'm an expert. There's probably one. He put that one back under there. I saw that. I saw that, boy. You can't get away from me. Oh, there was another one under there. I told you there was another one under there. Oh, there's three. I don't know where the third one came from. Okay. He just put a big one inside. in that one. Course, Where did the big ones come from? Oh American crap, they got me. Baseball. After we had done the uh, American uh, version of the cups and balls a few times, wanted to kind of zoom in yeah. and do a pen and tell it. kind of lost me with the big ten. A few rules of magic. Now the okay. first rule of magic is you never do the same trick twice. Are you going to do it again? Sometimes. I'm ready for this. Second okay. rule of magic is you never tell an audience how a trick is being done. I'm going to tell you exactly how that trick is being done. Ooh. The third rule of magic is you never let the audience see your secret preparation. Oh. They must not know what is hidden in which pocket. Okay. And the fourth rule of magic is unwritten, but I believe any magician in the world would agree with us in a second, that you never ever do the what? cups and balls with clear plastic Cups. Okay, this Where's is pretty neat. Okay, so it started with one under there. The I think we predicted balls. that one, and then we saw the motion. He put that one in that hand the there, cup. and then the he did a fake. Ball, what? That one was so early. Oh, oh man. Show it. To the third and final okay, ball, I saw that one, the and then I saw that one go in there. And I didn't see that one. He got me on that one. He Each put the, the three under there, we caught that one, one. so the, somehow they got away with these two and I didn't notice. I didn't notice that one because he was doing that to distract me. And then he has a big old baseball, which we caught. And of course for the finish, it's an American baseball. Okay. That was pretty cool. I like that a lot. I want to learn more magic tricks from you guys. Can you make an entire game just like this so that I can learn lots and lots of magic? Because that feels like the best way to possibly learn a magic trick. 
Great, now I'm in the mood to learn magic. I'm gonna go spend two hours on YouTube after this to learn some new magic tricks, everybody. It's gonna be pretty exciting. Okay, so we have one more experience, probably the most exciting experience. We get to be Houdini. Now this one looks a little bit terrifying, so if you're scared of tight spaces or drowning, uh, hold on to your butt, because it's about to get real. Oh. Good evening. Oh. We are Penn and Teller, and it is Check our it pleasure out. to present to you a little water torture chamber act called Houdini, oh. named after our backstage Wi-Fi, which is named after the escapologist Harry Houdini. Oh. Watching cheating magicians pretend to do Houdini stunts is not a tribute. Okay. A real tribute would be to truly demonstrate how hard his stunts were cool. by taking a random person who had no idea what they were doing and plop him or her into this claustrophobic Oh, that's great. Nightmare. I'm glad I could be your guinea pig. That's where the person behind us comes in. Okay. They're getting ready now as I speak. Huh? First, binding the hands together. This is optional, but for the okay. full experience, we recommend it. The straps of the controllers are perfect for Oh, this. okay, I can do this, I can do this. Hold on, let's pause it real fast. I'm gonna bind my hands together. Here we go, just take this one off. I'm just gonna run this strap through this strap, and then I'm uh, all bound up. There we go. I've got a little bit of looseness, as you would in any handcuffs, but I, I, think, I think that's pretty good. There's no getting away from that. Okay, okay, I'm all bound up. Bring it on, I'm ready for this. I'm not a chicken. Now that our volunteer is ready. Okay. Keys. Okay, keys, In keys. What the? Keys? Okay. Well, this doesn't seem so bad. Twist it. Ah. Give me all the freaking keys. I need more keys. Ah, keys. Keys. Okay. Okay. I can do this. I'm some sort of freaking expert at this. Uh, this is a little bit tricky, and I can definitely feel the pressure. Hello? Where's the lock? Where's the? Ah! There we go. Okay. I need more keys. I need more keys. Oh, it's filling up so quickly. It's filling up way too quickly. I'm not ready for this. I'm not ready for this, you guys. I thought I was ready. I'm not ready. Okay, here's an X. Where's the X? Where's the X lock? Oh, I'm so freaking slow. Where's the locks? Okay. Okay. Square. Square. Okay. That one. Twist. Okay. I don't know where this one goes to yet. Okay. That one goes there. I found it. Okay. I got a circle. I got a circle twist. I'm gonna drown. Okay. Where do I... Okay, don't worry guys, uh, I'm probably gonna die in here, but it's okay. I thought I was ready for this. I clearly was very wrong. Okay, I just gotta keep on doing that, and then I can breathe forever. Okay, twist that one. Give me, give me. Twist, twist. Yeah, baby! But more importantly, we are a Astonished okay. that our random participant has proven to be a master or mistress of escapology. Thank the you. The glass casket is a cruel and unforgiving mistress. Ugh. With an iron will, they stared her directly in her reptilian eyes and broke free of all restraints. Oh yeah, baby. But did they really? But did you really follow all our directions before breaking the locks? Were your hands really tied up? Yeah, they are. Flailing them around like a silverback. I was only flailing around a little bit. Did you really hold your breath every time? You okay, you didn't you didn't specify that. I could have done that. I was jumping for air. Drowning at the same time. Okay. So try again. Do it. If you do it for real and break all the locks, we'll consider you a true master or mistress of escapology. Oh, thanks. Thanks, I, I can see you had so much faith in me. Okay, well, I'm pretty sure if I did that for real, I would actually end up dead. So we're not going to do that because that's not a good way to die. <laughs> Alright, anyways, I hope you guys have enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time, and hopefully my hands are no longer bound together.